Hello, my name is Sabina Brennan. Um, all of us here this evening are connected in three important ways. We are all graduates of the University of Dublin. We are all Irish citizens and we are all human beings. The first gives us power, the second gives us rights, and the third gives us humanity. As graduates of the University of Dublin, we are an elite and powerful group. In this instance, we have the power to elect three university graduates. This evening, I am going to ask you to vote for me, to vote for a senator who will advocate for the rights of older adults, of carers, and of people with neurological conditions, most of whom are not members of our elite group. Now I want you to step outside yourself for a moment. And I want you to step into the shoes. No, I want you to step into the slippers of an 87-year-old woman who has dementia. And I want you to imagine what it's like to have your right to be treated fairly, with dignity, and with respect denied on a daily basis. I want you to imagine what it's like to have your request to go to the bathroom ignored until such time as you have to soil yourself. I want you to imagine what it is like to be sedated for simply walking up and down a hospital corridor. Now, as a dementia researcher in Trinity College, I was aware that these things happen in some of our hospitals and some of our institutions in Ireland. But nothing, nothing prepares you for when that 87-year-old woman is your own mother. It is simply not good enough. We must do better. Now, it's too late for my mum. Sadly, she passed away on Valentine's Day. But it's not too late for your mum, and it is not too late for you. We here have the power to make a difference, the kind of difference that impacts on people's lives, even an 87-year-old woman with dementia. We're a small nation. We have big hearts. Fairness is a fundamental feature of our free state, and I believe that we can realise a true republic of equals. We're already succeeding. We are already leading the world on human rights and equality in so, so many ways. But in other areas, we are not only performing poorly, but we are failing miserably. We are failing older adults, we are failing carers, and we are failing people with disabilities. Older adults are not just bed blockers. People with disability are not just care recipients. They are rights holders. They are members of the general public and they should not be marginalised, excluded or consigned to the appendices of policy documents. We can do better. We must do better. We deserve better health. We deserve better education. Indeed, I believe that we can be the best. We gradu graduated from Ireland's premier university. We do not like to fail. We do not accept second best, and we shouldn't expect anyone else to. By adopting a human rights and equality action plan, by investing in research, education, and in health, and by taking a few key strategies off government shelves, we can make Ireland the best country to grow up and grow old in. An Ireland where human rights and equality are an integral part of our natural, national identity and simply a natural part of our everyday lives. I'm going to be cheeky now and I'm going to ask you not just for your number one vote, but I'm going to ask you to ask three members of our elite organisation to also vote for Sabina Brennan. We can do better. Thank you.